Okay, delighted to be joined by Desi Farrell, Dublin Senior Football Manager here at Parnell Park after his side's uh, De Orlite O'Burn Cup semi final win over Wexford. Desi, 5 17 to 111. Uh, you can't be anything but happy with that uh, performance today? Yeah, it was a good day out for us for sure. Uh, very happy with how the lads played. Um, they applied themselves really well. I think the the victory and the manner of the victory last week against Affley obviously gave a bit of confidence. It was for many of them it was their first day to play senior competition with, with Dublin so uh, it was probably a big occasion and some nerves maybe in the first half and that but settled into it and obviously got the result and I think that um, served them really well coming into today's game that bit of confidence and self-assurance was great to see yeah and I guess two, two very different games in that regard you kind of had to battle all the way through last weekend obviously today a little bit more comfortable uh, certainly that third goal just for half time gave it that maybe six point lead I think it was at half time yeah. and you were able to kick on then the second half yeah the, the run of goals definitely helped and uh, you know when when you've banged in a few goals um, it's easier to play with, with that little bit more confidence and um, and uh, you know the lads grew into the game and it was great to see it and again good performance all over the park Liam Smith was named uh, the uh, club around the match uh, after the game but obviously Sean Larry uh, would have had his hand up for that as well from the point of view of scoring a hat-trick and, and getting five goals as well so a good performance like pretty much from 1 to 15 yeah across the pitch across the pitch uh, very happy across all the lines uh, Luke Bannock a very good outing as well um, Ethan Dawn uh, Kevin Le Hiff, uh Brian O'Leary, they were, they were all very impressive, you know. Um, so, yeah, look, at it's just, we've another day out. It's great to give these players that bit of exposure, a bit more exposure and experience in the Bone Cup final next weekend. And I'm sure they and their families, and we're all looking forward to it. Yeah, and I guess this time of the year, Desi, what are you kind of looking for, I guess, from the guys? Because it is about maybe performing to kind of put their hand up in terms of being part of the panel or the team going forward into the into the league and championship, obviously. So what are you kind of looking for the guys at this time of the year? Yeah, I think from a management perspective, it's just a case of uh, seeing who's ready to make the step up, you know. So, so that's why getting to see them in proper competition is, is invaluable for us. And it's just a case of who's putting the hand up. And, uh, you know, talent is one aspect of it for sure. But that, that hunger and desire and, and that um, attitude is something that we're watching closely for as well and, and definitely there's a few candidates in the mix to, to make the step up to the senior squad. Yeah, and finally, it's the Old Burn Cup final uh, next weekend. It's Longford in the Old Burn Cup final next weekend. So I guess another game from your point of view to, to have a look at guys, but also a chance to win some silverware as well. Yeah, and you know, the, it's great and um, to be playing in a, in a final, for, particularly for players like this, uh, Bone Cup final is a special occasion for them. You, you know, we don't, we won't get too uh, caught up on the result again. It's just about the exposure and the experience for those lads and working on the couple of things we we're working on, trying to bed them down, seeing how quickly they're adapting to it, how quickly they're learning. And uh, today was encouraging from that point of view. We've another week to do a little bit more work and, and see what next weekend brings.